I'm Nicole Hacko with Royal LePage Top Producers and for today's Wednesday Wisdom I have Councillor Marcus Chambers with me. So we've got your house as the victim, <laughs> your sump pump as the victim and we're going to talk about sump pumps. Um, I think we've all seen the ones that go where they're not supposed to go and do what they're not supposed to do. So what do you have to say about it? Yeah, and it's, it's very problematic in the winter time when sump pumps are still discharging water and uh, the colder weathers uh, result in ice buildup. Yeah. Uh, so there is a city bylaw respecting sump pumps. Sump pumps are to drain on to your front property. If you have a back lane, you can drain your sump pump to your back lane because there are uh, drains there that allow water to to, uh, to discharge water to drain into the into the uh, into the sewer lines there. But uh, for the most part, drain it onto por uh, porous areas that allow absorption of the water that's being discharged from your sump pump. Okay, so what can people do when you're that house that is ejecting straight onto a sidewalk? Well, well, again, uh, you do have the opportunity to get a hose that uh, can redirect it back onto your your property, back onto your uh, your lawn, and uh, so that it's not discharging onto the sidewalk. Where again, in the in the winter times, it can build up ice and it becomes very treacherous, especially for seniors and and yeah. for kids. Yeah, absolutely. And then if somebody notices a sump pump that isn't going where it's supposed to go, what can a community member do? They can call 311 and we'll send out a bylaw enforcement officer to assess the situation. Uh, there are circumstances where you get two driveways that are side by side and you get that little bit of a triangle yeah. area there. Uh, I noticed that there's a lot of people that uh, do dig out those areas and have rock in there as opposed to grass. Yeah. It's still okay to discharge your, your uh, sump pump there. But uh, again, it can build up on ice. It's preferred that you do it on your lawn where again, it can be absorbed into the ground. Okay, perfect. Well, that's our Wednesday wisdom for the week. I hope you learned a little bit about sump pumps. And if you've got any questions, you can always let Marcus or I know. Thank you. Okay, take care.